Hello, hello, hello. How are you guys doing today? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to watch a movie trailer. A lot of people were saying don't watch this. A lot of people were saying watch this. So I don't know what to do. And uh, because it's a Vice documentary film, I'm going to watch it because I love Vice and I love everything they do. This one is called An Insignificant Man. This is a story about uh, Arvind Kejriwal. I don't know Kejriwal about Kejriwal, but I know that he is one of the independent sort of a person who is you know, a common party. I know that. So let's go and watch An Insignificant Man. जिन लोगों को यह लगता है कि आम आदमी पार्टी को सरकार नहीं बनानी चाहिए वो जरा हाथ खड़ा कर we said we're not interested in politics, we're only interested in anti-corruption movement, we entered politics. What is his status? Arvind Kejriwal has a reputation of being extremely intolerant of other people's views. What's going on, Yogendra Yadav? We thought this is a party with a difference. Your candidates were different. This is really low level. Aam Aadmi Party is the most corrupt party. We had a lot of hope from them. But now we put you to task. Yes, Arvind has energy, he has also box thinking, he has the ability to cut through various things and to come to the core. Okay, let's then turn to the big question we are posing. Can Kejriwal really succeed as a politician? Okay, so this movie slash documentary called an insignificant man which translates to aam aadmi basically i don't know much about arvin kejriwal but in this trailer se bhi mujhe zyada to idea nahi hua of course because the trailer was mostly about how good the documentary is sirf bade bade text mein ye aata tha ki bahut achhi bani hui hai vice is great vice is you know the best i couldn't really tell much ke video mein kya ho raha hai i didn't understand ki kya ho kya raha tha ki he was iski life story ye lag rahi hai ki he has been trying to fight corruption in india aur is bande ki corruption ke against fight ne jo hai iske sath bahut achhi aur buri cheeze ki hain his own party member were caught taking bribes I think on video this is why his morale was broken and uh, but he I, I think he is still fighting for, for anti-corruption movement he is the current chief minister of Delhi I think current and seventh chief minister of Delhi since February 2015 so he, he is the CM of Delhi right now and he is trying to create his own political party which 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 is based on which is running on platform of uh, anti-corruption now as you guys know I don't like to discuss too much politics on my channel and I'm not gonna say that it's a good person, a bad person, it's a side low, it's a side low I'm just talking about objective facts that he's doing and what's going on with him and it and uh, looks like he, he is he is one of the one of the good people in, 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 in India he is against the established uh, ruling parties the BJP and the other one I think his cause jo hai, wo kafi logo ko hai. even though uske saath hai, even though uske saath sabotage hua hai, I still think that his fight is really about the common man iska hulia batata hai ki ye common man ke liye lada hai, iski baate batati hai, iska demeanor batata hai ki he is for the common man because he is one of the common people I don't know aage ja ke zyada power milke log badal jate hai, nahi badal jate who knows that's something we can never you know know in advance but uh, I wish him all the best and I I, I, I hope uh, Indian people see the, see the message he's trying to bring and I, I hope he gets 
more and more support. That moment was really good when he was supporters and said that people think that we government to make a government. And everybody raised their hands and I was like, wow, that's some open dialogue right there. There's no fear of, you know, persecution that if I say something against it, something will happen. In Pakistan, it's not like that. In Pakistan, if you want to say something about someone, first keep a bodyguard here, then keep another bodyguard here, then keep a third bodyguard in front of you and a fourth bodyguard behind you. So that they will kill you first, then they will kill you. In Pakistan, you're not allowed to say anything about army, about judiciary, about religion, about politicians are the only people who can say anything about you and do it. And they are also very angry. We politicians are angry. They don't have any wrong. They get the opportunity to come and make their money. If they don't make their money, they will do good work. They will get a good job. They will get a good job. They will get a good job. So that's Pakistan in a nutshell for you guys. I hope we also get people like Arvind Kejriwal and not people like Imran Khan. I guess he's a nice guy, but he's not totally fair and he's not totally honest about what he's doing in the country. So, yeah, these these things might sound controversial, but it is also based on reality. Well, that's politics. Uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys like my reactions and my opinions. If you guys want me to watch more videos, let me know on my website, PakistaniReactions.com or leave it leave your request in the comments or whatever. Uh, I will see you guys tomorrow with another trailer or a funny video or a stand-up comedian. We'll see. Take really good care of yourself. I love you guys. Shabakhair.